Hey guys, Shay here. You probably know by now that I really don't like Black Ops 3. You know that I personally think it's uh, it's one of the worst CODs ever, if not the worst. I haven't really been playing that a lot. I've been playing Ghosts more, so I haven't really been playing that much lately, but um, s s this thing caught my eye, obviously. Um, I was browsing YouTube and I, I used the Xbox One to play, so I don't have the DLCs. And I saw this DLC content and I thought it was pretty cool, you know, I thought like, cool, they're you know, putting up DLCs, like, this is good, this is cool. And, you know, I, uh, I couldn't wait for the DLCs just to come out for the one. But this isn't really gonna be about the DLC, this is gonna be about the guns. And if you guys really don't know what happened, like, it's actually retarded. So if you guys know that Advanced Warfare now has a MP40 and AK-47, and all these new guns that I don't have, I have one of them, it's a blunder bust, and it's like, it's a musket shotgun that literally no matter what, you, you will not. You, it's like impossible to hit harder, but it's a, uh, it takes so long to reload. But it's a pretty good, cool gun, I'm glad I unboxed it. Um, yeah, you have to unbox it. You don't buy it, right? You don't unlock it. You don't buy it with points or experience or whatever. You have to, um, in BO3 use your crypto keys or in AW just get your supply drop because you don't need keys or anything. And so, they uh, finally did something like that with VO3, which, when you first think about it, yeah, it's kind of cool. Like, I think they added, uh, they added some really old rifle from World War. I'll probably be helping ahead. They added this, uh, revolver type of pistol. It's a one shot and kill with two bullets. It's like a mini burst shotgun. And then they added a crossbow. They added a sword and, you know, all those knife stuff there. I think they added two. But, um, they also added the. God, what was it called? I forgot what it was called. Let's see, let's see if I can find it here. Uh, they added the they added the M1 Grand or Garand, whatever you want to call it. Same thing. Um, they added that right. It was a assault rifle, I believe. That or a submachine gun. I really don't. I'm pretty sure it's assault rifle. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Like I at first when I saw this, I thought it was cool. And then I started playing to try to get some crypto keys, and um, that's kind of where I realized this is complete and utter bullshit. Cause then I saw all these YouTubers just buying thousands of keys just to unlock all these rares and get like the most insane camos in the game, right? Um, which is actually complete bullshit. It's complete bullshit. Now, in CSGO, you you know, you can buy cases and keys and get skins for your guns, which I think is fucking w the way better system than Call of Duty. Um, Call of Duty does give you skins, but now they give you guns. That's the problem. That is the one problem. Um, you can't- imagine if you opened up a shadow case and they had- let's say if they never patched the revolver and you could get that out of case, but you'd have to get out of the case to use it, like, that's so bullshit, and everyone knows it, it's not pay to win, but it pretty much is pay to win. Now, the guns aren't really, like, amazing or anything, they're pretty good though, they're not- you know, all DLC guns are pretty good. Like, but yeah, I just think that's really stupid how they would do something like that. Like, Ghost, for example, I, I think that's stupid too. That was actually pay to win. You had to buy a DLC for a gun. Like, wh what? That's fucked. You didn't do that, and one of the best snipers was in that DLC. The M Mark whatever, I don't even know. I think this whole pay to win bullshit is stupid. Or at least, like, let them get it a month early in supply drops and then release it to the public. Like, you know, at least do something like that. Obviously, that could happen. Who knows? But anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please show up a like and commenting, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.